All right. Temple Builder's Guide. All right, I'm going to guide you how to build that temple. So here we go. Meditation time. Once you get to a comfortable position, right, go ahead and follow my lead. After a while, you don't have to listen anymore. Just zone out. All right. So here we go. First things first. There's two things to worry about. Not worry about, sorry. And we're going to be working on with this certain meditation. One is going to be clearing your mind. Two is repairing anything that might be wrong with our bodies right now. Maybe uh, 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 a strained ankle or something. Believe it or not, you can fix it that quick. Right? As long as it's not a broken bone. Right? And even broken bones, you can speed up the process. Right? Through meditation, through the train of thought. All right, here we go. So keep that in mind. Second thing is the breathing. Always, always breathe in through your nose. You can let it out through your nose and let it out through your mouth, but don't breathe in through your mouth like a fish. <laughs> if you breathe in like a fish, in through your mouth, you're not breathing in much oxygen. It's more CO2. So that means less oxygen to your brain, less concentration. All right? Not only that, but you're not releasing stress, meaning tension, you're not releasing toxins. You release 70% of toxins through breathing alone. All right, so when you breathe in through your nose, you gather tension. You release it through your mouth, you release it. Not only that, you're burning calories because you got to squeeze that diaphragm to release that air, okay? And again, 70% of toxins being released through, their, through that process alone. Only. So concentrate on that breathing, listen to yourself. Be loud. Don't be ashamed to sound out loud like a bass. All right, so the, more, the louder you sound, the more toxins you're releasing, the more stress you're releasing, the more calories you're burning, the more definition you'll be gaining eventually. And the better benefits, more clearing thoughts, stuff like that. Right, so here we go. First you're gonna do is breathe really deep in through your nose. You're gonna hold it for a few seconds, right to the point to right before you start to panic, and then release it really slowly through your mouth, all right? So be playful with that breathing, meaning the next breath, let it be longer. So you're trying to challenge yourself like a little game to make that breath out longer and slower because that goes to show evidence that you are truly relaxing your heart, your mind, your body, everything, all right? Mind, body, spirit. Here we go, again, just keep doing it, keep listening and adjust however you want. Into your nose, hold it for a few seconds. Release it through your mouth. Again, breathe in through your nose. As you're doing so, picture a fine, bright, bright light coming down from God. Whether you believe it or not, believe in God or not, just believe in that light that's coming down from above, from the source, source of all life, right? That light is lighting up your spine. Any darkness that's inside of you, all of us have darkness, right? From a little bit of stress, whatever the case may be. Light up that darkness inside of you with that light. Again, keep breathing, even though I'm talking. In deep through your nose and let it out through your mouth. Picture that light, whatever color it may be, white, light blue, magenta, whatever. Whatever you consider to be peaceful right now. In through your nose, hold it, and release it lightly. <laughs> All right, this is the point where you start to erase the rest of the world. This is your time, your time only. If you want to be alone, be alone. If you want to be with God, be with God. But this is alone time, not the world time. Keep picturing that light, lighting up that darkness. Little by little, you should be getting lost right now. Meaning, away from these sounds. If someone, something's distracting you, maybe the waves, be the waves. Contact with the waves. They have a lot of fun. They're going back and forth, ebb and flow, having fun. Teaching us things. If you want, start picturing anything that hurts. Go into your body, use your imagination. You're only limited to your creativity. Work on that shoulder if that's what hurts. 
Work on your knee if that's what hurts. Work on your ear if that's what hurts. Now you should feel a little bit of warmth in your stomach from every time you breathe out. Alright, so maybe a few more seconds and then I'm gonna stay quiet because I need to get lost. I need to get my alone time. Alright, so you're on your own from this point on. Keep picturing that bright white light. If you hear that seagull, be that seagull. Fly around inside that seagull. You'll have fun, trust me. Time to repair. No, not great. <laughs>
and then like hearing point? everybody laughing. Yeah. <laughs> As her point, I, I'm pretty sure I was laughing, uh, smiling too. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I like, towards the end, I was like, yes. And then I, I think I, I think I smiled right away. But it felt good. Is it the first time I you did the, it or what? The, what? Yeah, meditation and this one? Meditation period or this one? Meditation. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So I can tell but you yeah, got I lost. Yeah, the, the little kid. There was a little kid. Yeah. 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 He was that, that, yeah, that's see that when you did the right thing. Inner, like you can hear everything you now seeing it and feeling it. That's the picture of the little kid. He was like, what is it? Yeah. So see right now there's 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 at least three hundred people out here. Alright, I don't know about them, but little by little I just zoned in into the wave. And then just like she did yeah and that and yeah and then that one little kid too i heard that little kid it was weird um but that little kid helped not only me but her i don't know about liz but it helped belen but belen was the first time she did it liz did you, oh did you feel it did you get lost in a good way we all got lost in a good way all right uh i really do feel like I've rested for at least 10, 11 hours. I know you think I'm BSing, but seriously, I'm running on like technically nine, nine hours in the past three days. But right now I feel 40 times, and that's not an over exaggeration, 40 times than what I did this morning. I feel much better right now. This is insane. Like, I don't even feel like, I don't even feel like I worked out right now. Uh, even though I know I got the benefits of it. So, that's we work out to. Hopefully that little speck didn't mess things up. Anyways, Temple Builder's Guide, all right, which is empower the warrior spirit, our mind, our actual spirit, our body, okay? And we repair ourselves mentally, physically, spiritually, emotionally, release all kinds of stress through all that uh, activity we just did. Mind, body, spirit. Okay, I'm closing my eyes because it's really bright. <laughs> and like I said, I haven't slept much. Um, but I was still disciplined enough to get up, so to empower these ladies that decided to show up. Some of you didn't, <laughs> but it's fine. Uh, that's the way life goes. It's Sunday. I, go, I know you guys are partying Saturday night, so hey. These benefits are well worth that discipline, that, that you know, sacrifice of not partying with family and friends. So. Hopefully you attained some type of clarity like we did. And I'm surprised they got it and I'm glad, I'm happy that they got it as well. And that just makes, empowers me even more, knowing that I empowered them in such little time. Remember, you're only limited to your creativity, pain is temporary, pride is eternal, fulfillment lasts forever. The fight will be worth it. The efforts you put out, God will reciprocate, whether you believe in God or not, okay? The universe will reciprocate your efforts. Only good, baby. Only good. <laughs>